this is the helper here and today we are going to do the first tutorial on epic boss gold edition and we are actually going to create our first boss and the first thing we need to do is go into the server folder and go into plugins epic boss gold edition and then since we're going to create a new boss we have to go into mobs folder in this folder we will find mobs example uh, which comes with epic boss gold edition and it's some pre-made bosses so we can add our boss into this file or we can create a new one we are actually going to create a new one so the easiest way to do this is by creating a new text document uh, we open it up and save it again and we just save it as test boss.yml it's very important to have the .yml else it won't work so save it and we can delete the, uh, the normal text file and we have created a new yml file completely blank and I highly recommend you guys to download notepad++ since that's what I'm going to use and it's uh, very easy to use and I highly recommend it so we open it up and we can start put our boss inside. So the first thing you need to do is the name of the boss. This is the name that will be used uh, in commands and settings. So I'm going to name it test boss. Then you do two spaces and we do mob type. You can find all the mob types on the internet. You just go to the helper uh, dot com dash epic boss and we'll come to the main thread of epic boss gold edition i highly recommend you guys to read everything on this page but for now we are going to do uh, all mobs list and tags list and here we can find all the mob types and we are going to do a baby zombie so we will just copy and paste it in all right then we do next, which is display. And display is the name above their head. So we are actually going to do a green name uh, like this. Uh, and boss of trash. Or actually, we're just going to do this for now. And then we do health, the health of the mob, and it's going to be, let's put 200, and we put damage, 10, and the damage can be from 0 to whatever you want, but you have to test your way and see what uh, value you need to have, since 10 damage is around 3 hearts, I think, so you have to trial and error and see what fits your boss. And then we're going to do show hel uh, health and we set this to false for now. I will show you in a bit what it really does. And then we put this spawn. And this spawn if it's if uh, the uh, boss is going to despawn or not. If it you put this to false, it will never despawn, it will always be there. And if you put it to true, it will despawn when the player got uh, gets out of range or the chunks uh, get unloaded so we save it and we are actually going to start our server we can close this one start it up and if we check in the console we can see that we have a new mobs file testboss.yml so it has been loaded and we go in game There we go. Right, let's just put it today. All right. A bit lazy here. All right. So first thing we need to type is eb or need. We can just check is eb uh, mob mobs list. Sorry, mob list. <laughs> eb mob list. And we can see that the test bus is loaded, so we can actually spawn it. So we do eb mob uh, spawn test boss. And there we go, boss of trash. It looks kind of weird by the head, but if we do game mode zero, it will fix. 
You can see the damage is three hearts. I'm going to kill it. Yeah, as you can see, he has 200 health, so it's kind of hard to kill him. I hope I don't die, since that would be a shame. There we go. Now we can uh, actually change uh, a few things. So we step back into the uh, plugin folder, locate ourselves to the new file, and open it up. We open it with Notepad++, and we are going to change this to true. The show health, so it will show the health when you hit the boss. And we're actually going to pin this with some colors, so you can use color codes. You can find the color codes on uh, on the internet. You can just Google uh, Minecraft chat colors, and you will find them. So we're actually going to do uh, a golden name, and we are going to have gray brackets mm, like this. Oops. And inside we're going to have uh, a green name and we're going to call it a level 1 mob. There we go. And make sure there are inside these little things. So save it. And we can go in game and do eb reload and it will reload the files. And we can spawn the, uh, the mob again. And you can see it's named Boss of Trash, level 1. And if we hit it, you can see it shows the health every 10% percentage. So yeah, we can just kill it. Uh. Yes! So we managed to create our first boss. And uh, this is everything for this tutorial. So I hope you like this video and I hope you see you next time. Uh, remember to subscribe and like uh, the video for more videos. See ya! Bye!